What's going on everybody? So I'm back in the video. Hope everyone's having a great day. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a Siri Pro mode on your iOS device. So this is going to be kind of like combining the Siri mode as well as the chat GPT kind of together all in one. So the first thing you will want to do is go to the Safari application and you basically want to register on their page. I'm going to get down below in the description. But once you do register, on the chat GPT page, what you want to do is click on the three little dots in the upper hand corner, go to your profile, and then we want to go to where it says that view API keys. So um, what you want to do from here is create a new secret key. So we're going to tap on that right there. It's going to create a brand new one. And obviously this is all completely free. It says API key generator. We're going to copy this key right here. And once we do uh, completely copy it, we're now going to go at a shortcut. So what you will need is to download the shortcuts application from the app store. Um, it is completely free. So I'm gonna show you guys real quick, head to the app store and search up the shortcuts application. There it is. So download this to your device. And once we have done that, we are going to be adding a shortcut. So this shortcut will also be in the description of the video and it is the API. So what we want to do is click on where it says to get shortcut open it in the shortcuts application and then from here tap on add shortcut so once we have done that we're going to look for that shortcut which is right here we're now going to click on the three little dots right there and then from here where it says text so basically at the top of the page this is where we want to copy our um, api key so we've already copied that from the website so we're going to paste that in right there and then click on done and then from here we're going to scroll down just a bit and then where it says ask for text with, um, it's going to be obviously in a different language. We're going to switch this to how may I help you. And the next thing we want to do is actually go to the top of the page and actually change the name of this. So we're going to change this to Siri Pro Mode, just like this right here. So let me just actually put a capital M. And there we have it. So once we have done that, we're going to click on done right here. And there is the shortcut. So now we obviously got to enable it. So we're going to tap on it and it's going to say, how may I help you? We'll just tap on OK or just uh, type in OK, done. And then it's going to ask us uh, to allow. Um, so basically allowing this shortcut to connect to the API. Once we are done adding the shortcut, we are good to go. So if I were to use Siri as I normally would, hey, Siri. What's the recipe for lasagna? You'll see it just give me a uh, website link as well as I can just search on the web and it'll open up the Safari application where I can just click on one of the links. But if I were to actually use the chat GPT, you will see right here, launch Siri Pro mode. What's the recipe for lasagna? And you will see it is going to be running through the shortcut as you will see on the dynamic island. This part obviously will take a lot longer uh, than actually just using the regular Siri. But you will notice that it will give us all the ingredients for lasagna as well as a step-by-step -step guide. We got six instructions right here. So there you guys have it. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. In my opinion, I wish Apple did something like this where it just made Siri a lot more smarter. But if you did enjoy this video, it did help you out. Drop a like on the video. Hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys never miss a video. And that's basically it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.